Today we're going to be visiting with a few shopkeepers in the village of East Hampton to hear what they have to say about the current state of the economy and how they think this summer will be. Since we don't lay off anyone, it became a little bit difficult to uh, to stay above water in the winter time. It, it became very tough. But I have good credit, I borrowed money, and uh, so we kept everyone on, which was excellent, because in the springtime when the business really goes, uh, you need everybody on board and experienced people. Good weather brings people, and the economy, as far as I can see out here, is starting to turn around. Uh, I find that more homeowners are doing work themselves. They're coming in and buying light bulbs. They're coming in and, and do a little plumbing themselves. And if the economy continues the way it is, and the weather stays the way it is, I think we have a very good season. We've owned these stores for 39 years. And we've seen a lot of changes. It's been challenging. Um, every year is a challenge to get through the winter. And just when you think that April is here, we realize that April is not the beginning of our season. It doesn't really kick in until May, June. Not until our customers come out for the summer. This town could not survive without New York coming here and with the influx of people. Um, we thrive on it. I think every store does. I know from my store, our prices are the lowest you can sell it at. And there will be no difference between coming, going here, going to New York, or going to Riverhead. So we want them back. We want our locals back. We're going to our 39th year and thinking about our 40th year. And our customers are waiting for it because we always have um, giveaways every week of our, every five years. We did it from 15, 20, 25, 30, and it's hard to believe that next year will be 40. Hi, I'm Patia Cunningham. I'm director of the body shop at 26 Newtown Lane in East Hampton. It's above Eileen Fisher. Um, this is my 33rd year here, and um, I teach yoga, and I'm a massage therapist. I guess people don't come as often as they used to. You know, people used to come to class a few times a week. Now maybe those same people might come once a week. Where I was doing more massage therapy, I'm actually doing more yoga therapy. So people are actually coming to me with health problems and stress-related problems and, and even being sent by doctors and physical therapists. So that's sort of where my, my work is going. Yoga is one of the best remedies and best uh, things you can do for stress. So in these stressful times, come to yoga. It was a long, tough winter, but we survived. <laughs> like everybody else, we've been here since 1873, and we're still here, and we plan to be here for many more years. I think that people are tired of talking about the economy, and rentals are back up, the sales are back up, and people want to come out and spend money. There's excitement because there's a lot of new stores in East Hampton, so they're really excited about it and people are shopping again. And there's a lot of traffic uh, coming and going, so uh, I think we're going to see a very good summer this year. I've been in this location for years. I was in my half-size half location for 12. So I consider myself a gift store more than a toy store, but I think at the moment I'm the only toy store left standing in East Hampton, so I've embraced it a little more. Life in East Hampton is difficult, and unfortunately the change in town, where there are so few local stores left, it works for and against me. It's against me because I'm now a destination. Sometimes in the winter, I'm one of very few that are even open. So it, it's rough. I'm thrilled that summer's here because the weather's beautiful. In general, I think we're very lucky to be here and we're very lucky that people still come here and that we have a big local community that lives here and does want to shop local when they can. This um, Con Sports EHI wear, 
Uh, Con Sports has been here for 13 years. Uh, EHI wear mostly sunglasses, as you can see. Um, it's been here about four years. Um, this winter, I would say, was a long winter, but it actually held up pretty well. We're able to pay our bills, so that's uh, above water, so we're good. Um, yeah, so now it's been a, a great start of the season for us, but um, I'm thankful. For the summer, I think I'm really stoked. The weather's here. I mean, people have been cooped up all winter. I mean, I, not that I was, but I ended up doing you know, landscaping and whatever I could um, just to get by, and now I'm ready, you know, just like bring on the season. So I'm pretty good.